And welcome back to the Artist Lounge. This just in, Dirk, as you were walking on, you were on the phone. Yeah. Uh, uh, who were you talking to? I was talking to my wife and my kids about this third dog. They've been hammering me about three dogs. And I'm always like, we have two dogs, three kids. That's a lot. That's, That's a, a lot. full boat. But they really want a third a third dog. So, uh, Goose, there's a, there might be a little, we'll see. Could be Look a at, he's there. like looking at you I right know. now. He's like, like buddy. I, I said that I was so impressed that he called his wife. He didn't just make a decision without... Oh. Bringing yeah. her along, yeah, yeah. the dog, and, there, he's, just, just, and he's only getting one of, brothers, one of the brothers. One of the brothers. Really, they're really trying to make this happen. They right? are. Look at that. They know how to do it. Yeah. So this yes. is, okay. So while you're holding your new yes. uh, family edition, so here's the thing: we know you're on tour, yes. but you'll also be performing. Tell me about the Seven Peaks festivals in Colorado. Oh, wait, wait, before we do, what? we've got a little a little piece to show. For. Oh, cool. Let's okay, see. Let's, let's take a look at this. I'm excited. <laughs> Dirks Bentley has been rocking the country charts for more than a decade. The Phoenix born singer has more than 6.4 billion digital streams. Some days you just breathe. And 16 number one Billboard Country Airplane Somewhere on the Like his debut single, What Was I Thinking? What was I thinking? Every mile of memory. Every song another scene. Hold on. 2018, The Mountain, became his seventh album to reach number one. Thank God for this woman, amen. And now he's here in the Artist Lounge to bring us a taste of his Burning Man tour, which has been turning up the heat across the country. There you go. See, I put that together and yeah. all about it. First of all, your hair is always great. It was pretty different, long back different then. Different yeah, looks. a lot of looks. And then one, in one of those videos, I was just asking you about the backdrop. It looks beautiful yeah and that's where the festival that's where our place. festival is yeah it's the town of buena vista it's uh, colorado about two hours uh west of denver and mm. it's just this great location with there's seven 14 000 foot mountains surrounding this one Golly. site that's why we call it seven peaks and it's just you know it's a place where i can i get to curate the music obviously mm. so luke bryan you know Marin morris biggest names in country music uh, as well as great bluegrass artists a lot of great 90s country because we love 90s mm. country so travis tritt tracy lawrence uh but on top of that, I want my fans to have a chance to experience what I love was the mountains. It's just my place where I go to recharge. So you come out here, you hear great bands, great music, but then you're also just in a place that's going to inspire you, hopefully for the rest of your life, sure. and just make positive changes in your life. It's such a powerful location, and uh, so it's, it's really special. It's my favorite thing I do. And this is your festival, and yeah. you've you've got a great giveaway. Go yeah, on. I do. Yeah, so I, uh, you know, I just I just got off a mountain yesterday, right? I was, I was climbing the Grand Tetons in Wyoming. At, 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 it was. 13, 7, 7, 5, almost a 14, 14 er uh, I just, and I just, it's what I love to do. And so, yeah, that was yesterday. <laughs> or two days ago. Yeah, I guess that was, yeah. I, I haven't slept in a little bit. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it was unbelievable. Yeah, there we were at the top of this mountain. So I just, that's how I recharged. And I was like, man, I'd love to take my fans on something like that. Um, didn't have to be that, you know, ropes yeah. and, 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 and rappelling, but just like a climb, Buena Vista, Seven Peaks has great hiking all around there. It can just be a small hike, just walk, you know, just go for a 30 minute hour, I haven't sure. really decided a uh, hike, and uh, just at the end of that, have a concert and kind of an acoustic performance, and just, yeah. you know, just that's what we're there for, let's yeah. let, get recharged. And uh, I'd love to offer uh, anyone out there, if you can find somebody, or do two Are people. You yeah. <laughs> like, so you're doing a giveaway? Yeah, okay. we'll give away some tickets to the concert. Um, Are you do this on your website? Or? Facebook. Facebook. Okay, you're doing yeah. this on okay. So we're, this isn't today, this is this Yeah, is Dirk, so on so my Facebook, Facebook page, we're gonna, um, I love to just get some people out there, get two Recharge. people, pay your plane tickets, we'll take care of your travel, wow. your lodgings. Uh, you realize you, you you're can, about to have hundreds of thousands of uh, <laughs> I know, it's a good platform, you, thank because you. Because you write, you talk a lot about being present and being mm. mindful and being in the moment. How do you do that, being successful, being on the road? What's your practice? I think kids have been the greatest teacher mm. I've ever had. I mean, they just, they break you down mm -hmm. <laughs> to no nub, <laughs> <laughs> and then they, you rebuild, and you either, either like, you either win, or you, they either, either work with them or you get run over by them, basically. So I think they've just taught me to be really present in the moment. They're, it's shifting sands. They're always changing. It's never the same. And so you can only, I've taken a thousand pictures, a thousand videos. I mean, 10,000. You, you, you never video? look at them. You never look at them because all you have is the present moments. So it's mm -hmm. like, I don't even carry my iPhone much anymore because like, I can take a picture of this, but I'm never going to. That's right. It's gone. Just be it's, there. All you have is that one moment with them. So We asked on Twitter for some of our your fans to, to write in, and uh, this is from Kelly Belly Alone. My burning question for Dirks is, what's the funniest or strangest thing a fan has ever done? 
I mean, the most crazy thing to me is someone they tattoo like you. Just, they you sign their arm, they come back like next year, and they have they've turned it into a tattoo. Yeah, you know, I mean, I feel such a huge responsibility there not to screw up and be do something to, to make them be like, I want to get rid of that tattoo. Uh, yeah, That's crazy. I've had you know, I've just a lot of, to me, I mean, a lot of funny things, but a lot of meaningful things. You know, military guys give you one of those coins. Mm -hmm. You know, they push oh, that yeah. in your hand and. Uh, just all, all the, the police and firefighters who played for over the years. And um, I've signed a baby's head. The baby was about three weeks old, and oh. she gave me a Sharpie, and I was like, I can't do it. She's like, right here. I'm like, I can't. She's like, right, sign right here. All right, so I signed this baby's head. Was, the skin was transparent. I was like, I feel like I was signing her poor skull. Oh, no. um, so there's been some, they're, but they're just passionate fans, man. They love, <laughs> they love their country music, and uh, I'm proud to be their, their lead loved. singer. You're I'm very loved. loved, very grateful. <laughs> well, stick around because Derek Spintley has a song just for the artist lounge. We're taking it outside. We'll be right back.